Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Demo for Team Gear here. I'm um, coming back at you again with another um, Kaiju deck uh, Kaiju deck list. Oh, well. <laughs> um, uh, Kaiju ranked match. Um, so yeah, we're 2-0 right now. Beat Blue Eyes and beat ABC. So here we go. F let's see how we do against DDD. All right, all right, all right. Okay, so he's going to go Pod Desires after activating uh, Dark Contact with the Gate. Okay, get some more drop power. All right. I'm presuming he's going to search. Um, Oh wow, and or darkness. Holy cow. Yeah, that deck <laughs> I mean if he's running three pot desires, I mean and then three alert, that's a lot of draw power. <laughs> he's pretty much guaranteed to have an opening a good opening hand with that. As long as he doesn't banish uh, anything uh, like a playset off of pot desires, but yeah, so how are we doing? We're doing okay. I can tribute over whatever monster he summons with um Doggeran and then special summon uh Thundercane to Lightning Shot Kaiju. Um, yeah, of course that will all happen after I activate the field spell, but yeah. Alright, so he's activating that, trying to add a card to hand. I don't think, yeah, he hasn't added it yet. Okay. So, yeah. Alright, DD Necro Slime. Okay, that's one Banish from Grave Infusion. That's the one send, send, <laughs> Mon monsters to clean that from hand to Grave Infusion. I mean, this deck is really freaking good, man. I mean, like, they have a lot of synergy. Um, but, like Kaji's, they like, also died to anti so many stuff. Um, yeah, but when that, um, I honestly, I have to profess my ignorance, um, I don't really know, like, what we're missing in terms of what's in the structure deck and what we have now, but, um, when that comes, yeah, they're definitely gonna be meta for sure. I mean, they're already seen play now, but when they get their full support, better look out, man, they're gonna be, they're gonna be dope AF. Um, alright. Let's see here. Alright, so... You can target special, okay, and then when this is summoned, send a DD or Dark Contract from Deck to Grave, okay. So, Foolish, that's nice, that's nice, okay, okay. Um, he's sending Ragnarok, alright. So then he has a Sync it. he has a Crystal Wing play, which is fine, because I can just tribute over him. But, um, yeah, he's going for another Fusion play, another one of those, okay. Um... And this, what, uh, no, this guy, that guy can't negate anything, but, oh, he's going for Siegfried, okay. Um, and then, that guy's effect is triggered, gets a special summon the monster, um, from Grave, he's going Ragnarok, okay. I wonder if he's actually gonna go for a rank 8 here, we'll have to see. And um, when this, this guy's special summon, he's supposed to summon our guy from Grave, wow. Okay, yeah, well, he has a whole ton of board right now. Um... Okay, so wow, so he can do that because he can just send a monster and put someone back. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. um, now he has another synchro play. Now he's probably gonna go crystal win. Um, yeah, that that makes sense. Um, so um, uh, yeah, I gotta tribute over to crystal win because otherwise I can't freaking beat over him. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna activate this spell and see what happens. He's probably gonna go. Um, he's probably gonna negate with Siegfried, but. That's fine by me. Um, oh, he's using Twin Twister. Snap. So that's, this is still, so, Zigbury's still alive then. I mean, he can negate the terror for me if he wants to, but, um, yeah. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, he's gonna negate the terror for me. Okay, okay. Um, so, yeah, next I'm gonna 110% tribute over that crystal wing though. Um, yeah, okay. And then next I'm gonna special summon this guy. Um, since I don't catch you counters in the field, I'm not too worried. And I have the bomb list for any rank eight he might try to play. Um, Kaliuga could be a problem, but yeah. I'm not too worried. So yeah, I'm gonna attack over Siegfried. Let's go sort of like, he will gain a thousand, but I'm fine with that. Um, I just want that guy off the field for sure. Um, so yeah. And then set remove brainwashing and bombless and pass turn. All right, let's see what he d has. I mean, he's going to be able to get a search off the spell, so that's. I mean, that as always, that's pretty good. But yeah. Anyway, um, he still has to deal with this. I got a bombless for rank eight play, but he does have a. Oh well, that's annoying. Um. Oh no! Wow, I misplayed. I wasn't even thinking. Oh snap! I should have. 
Oh, damn. I should have. Oh. Wow. I should have um, waited for it to resolve. And then I, I was I did it now because the is going to go rank eight. But yeah, wow, man. Damn. Uh, sheesh. And he has several slime sorry, but another D, D, yep, and he does, okay. So he's gonna go for um, that guy, and I'm gonna have to banish that, yeah, 110%. Um, but yeah, wow, that sucks, man. So now I need to top deck a kaiju, basically, in order to come out of this. Um, wow, that's annoying. And he has Lamy alive in grave, what else does he have alive in grave? He has Swirl Slime alive in grave. And that looks like that's it, and that card don't do shit. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll have to pass turn, and hope he can't ODK me. But, like, I mean, he has a search, he has a card in hand, he has Swirl Slime. Like, it's not looking good. If that had been a Kaiju, it would have been great, because I could have tributed over Ragnarok. Broom Brain Rushing would have brought it back, and I would have attacked. But, as it is, yeah, and the heck did he just add? Another Abyss Ragnarok. Okay, and now he's going to air his first summon. Um, and I don't, the pendulum effect has the battle damage. Damn. Wow, so that's just straight up game, man. Um, wow. Yeah, that was a, that was a huge ass misplay on my part. Um, yeah, wow. Dang, yo. Can I just lose to DD, uh, DDD -D -D game one? Wow, alright, game two, boys. Let's do this. Um, we gotta win out here, but. I think it'll be okay. Um, definitely two max C, 110%. Um, uh, hmm. Kiss Apple, yeah, for Nerd Summon Gation. Um, Deep Jerk Apple for sure as well. Um, maybe DD Crow? I don't know. Um, all right, uh, yeah, I'm gonna side in one changes appearance and then have to start to add that stuff out. So that guy, um, drop a Gamma Seal, drop a Terraforming, uh, drop a Brainwashing, and drop uh, Cyberman. Okay, and let's go. Um, and I will be second to go because I can't do crap when I go first. So, um, yeah. So this is a pretty strong opening. I got two ki uh, I mean, I have three kaiju, but I mean, I have a two kaiju set up, so that's good. I have the fuel spell. Um, I mean, if I went first, I just would have set this and passed. So, you know, like, um, yeah. So there's that. Um, problem is now it's supposed to last duel. He knows I'm playing kaiju, so I wonder if he's going to try to play around that somehow. I'll just see. Um, if he gets banned, he's fiend out. Then I'm screwed because I don't have an out to that in the main deck. So, and I didn't side in breaker skill. So yeah, that could be. Potentially be a problem. Um, if he's not going to summon anything, then I can't do anything on my turn. Um, for sure, but we'll see. We'll see what happens here. Um, yeah. Saying three and passing? Alright, alright. Um, okay, so I'm going to activate this. Activate Kai Kaiyo 2? Kaiyo 2. Waterfront. See what he does. Um, and I'm going to activate Terraforming, and then I'm going to set the Deep Turk Drop Hole and pass. Um... Yeah, man. Okay, so he's going to activate that now. And he's pro yeah, he's 110% going to uh, ditch that card to pop the field spell. Okay. Um, yeah, add the add another field spell to hand, and I'm activating it because who knows? Maybe cards from his field will be sent to the grave um, during uh, his turn. Um, and set the back row and pass turn. Yeah, so let's see if we can recover, man. I hope we can. If we can't, then, um, dang. But, is there an eye place turn? Yeah, so he could just totally pop his field spell. And, yeah, he's... I've completely forgot about that. Yeah, he's gonna start pop it right off the bat. Um, oh, he's popping the back row first. It, oh, that's interesting. And does he have... Yeah, he can fusion summon. Um, so if he can OTK me now, then that's straight up game. <laughs> And I will be sad. I will be very sad. But anyway, um, yeah. If he can't game me, I'm fine. Cause unless he can somehow pop this twice, um, cause I'll just probably wind up tripping uh, over Gamma Seal. 
Oh wow, he's going for that pot of desires though. Damn, he only has 10 cards left. All right. Um, I'll probably tribute uh, over his Monster of Gamma Seal, then Splash to Summon um, uh, Jai Jizu Kairu, and then uh, attack over the Gamma Seal. But he's, okay, he's at searching a card. He has Necro Slime Grave, which is annoying. Okay, he has that. Um, he's gotta have a target in deck. Um, otherwise, yeah, otherwise he wouldn't have <laughs> added that probably. So Swirl Slime, and he has Necro Slime and Grave. Great, so he could potentially OTK me this turn. Um, wow, and he, yeah, he, that was a smart move, picking up the back row instead of the, instead of the, um, uh, what's it called? The, uh, field spell. Yeah, because I totally, I mean, uh, I don't know. Probably, I'd like to think it would have for a bigger play, but at the same time, I probably would straight up, uh, Deep Dark Trap hold the Blaze Kangas. Um, yeah, so he still has Necro Summon Grief and Lamia. Holy crap. Um, wow. If he can get the game, I'm gonna be salty. But yeah, anyway. So Nara Genghis Khan, and then, I mean, well, King Genghis, but yeah. And then, Alexander, Gus King Alexander activates Just Summon Lamia. Lamia's just gonna sink into Crystal Wind, probably. And then, it can still, it's gonna probably special summon itself back by tributing, um, Kepler. Um, so yeah, and he gets another special summon off Genghis. What targets does he have in Grave? Um, he has Ragnarok in Grave. Crap, this could be game. Urgh. I hope not, but it probably is. Like, yeah, I guess his effect, special summon. I'm pretty sure that's, is that game right there? This is five, yeah, that's 5,000. Wow, damn. Oh crap, you totally wrecked me. Ugh. Wow. Yeah, he totally wait. He didn't set monsters for a second because he knew I would get Kaiju out. And then he, to and then he went this turn where I only had back, back row. Yeah, that was smart. Wow. Um, damn, man. Can I just get two of the DDDs? Well, the short range should come to an end. Um, I'm definitely going to do another video tonight because that was pretty short for a match, but. Yeah, um, thanks for watching guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, again, Dr. Strange Review, I have 100% confirmed we'll be seeing it on November 4th. That's not technically open tonight, technically you can go see it Thursday, midnight, and on um, for a little bit. But, um, no, yeah, I'm going to be seeing that and doing review the weekend of. Um, and, yeah, if it, a lot, enough people subscribe to the channel, definitely buy the external TV driver and Star Wars Comer since. Um, uh, I mean, I am running tight on money, but if a lot enough people support that, I can definitely do that. And, um, what else? Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Just gonna keep doing these kinds of matches for a little bit, because I really enjoyed the deck and all, and just want to see how well we can be. Um, this guy was smart, though, especially game two. I mean, he played around the kaijus 110%. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, yeah, and again, music courtesy of, uh, Bobby Sound on SoundCloud, so please check him out in the link, via the link below, and yeah, have a great